So our penultimate race here for the Dublin Festival is the Labrox Hurdle. It's a grade three handicap over two miles. Duke of Finsbury for Paul Rhodes is our top weight. Harold Humor for Darren Thompson is joint favourite. San Jose Buddy for Vinnie Gerrard. Baltic Dragoon for Pontypool Racing. Event Horizon for Joshua Sutherland. Our other 72 favourite. Fire Inferno for Paul Rhodes. Blinded for Pontypool Racing. And Arseflies for Craig Allen. Makes up eight. Starters got him away. That looks hurdle. Two miles. Left it's down. The rain stopped. Some reluctant leaders here. Nobody really wants to take this up. As they approach the first of their eight flights. It's finally San Jose Buddy. Jockey lets his horse start to run. So it's San Jose Buddy that's going to lead this into the first of the eight flights. Takes it well. Just a rest. So if you're running really wide here, widest of all is Fire Inferno. Two poor road sources. The grey just on his inside is Duke of Finsbury. The other grey up against the fence is blinded for Pontypool Racer. But his other colours are Baltic Dragoon. Red silks and yellow cap of arse flies for Craig Gunner. Unusual silk choices for him. And you've got Harold Humor for Darren Thompson. Joint favourite along with Event Horizon. Black silks, red hoops for Josh Sutherland. And just at the rear is Fire Inferno. He has not much racing room as they get to the second. It is still San Jose Buddy, a little bit slow over it. Just got a length advantage now from Ars Flies in second as they get to the third. Again, San Jose Buddy was a little bit slow. He was jumping a little bit better. He pushed along to maintain his lead. So he leads just by a length now to blind on his inside as they swing right handed, quite tight here. Out wide still is Duke of Finsbury. And the inside of that is Baltic Dragoon. Red Silks of Arse Flies and Josh's Event Horizon. Just at the two at the rear with no racing room at all. Harold Humid and Fire Inferno. We don't want to go too far wide as we approach the final turn. As they get to the fourth, which is halfway through the hurdles. It is still San Jose Buddy that leads us. Now he's jumping, has been a bit slow. Doesn't get away from the hurdles very well. It's San Jose Buddy from Blinded in second. And well up on the inside now is uh, Duke, not sorry, Event Horizon. They get to the fifth. So that's four from home. And it's San Jose Buddy that still leads from Event Horizon moving well up on the inside. And he got blinded, just taking a keen hold, being pushed through his arse flies. Moving well on the outside now is this Duke of Finsbury. He's going to try and get over towards the fence as we approach the turn. But it's San Jose Buddy that leads us over the six. Again, he was a bit slow, and Event Horizon draws alongside. Duke of Finsbury gets over towards the rail as he wished. And it's San Jose Buddy that still leads us from Event Horizon in second. Duke of Finsbury's third, being pushed along his arse flies. The other Paul Rhodes horse. Fire Inferno blinded the second grey up against the fence. Baltic Dragoon and Harold Humid towards the rear looking for racing room. They're going to have to go a lot wider, but it's San Jose Buddy that leads them over the penultimate. Takes it well. So San Jose Buddy just by a couple of lengths now from blinded the first of the greys. Event Horizon Duke of Finsbury up against the fence. Then we've got Fire Inferno out wide. Harold Humid still looking for room. Arse Ride running on. Baltic Dragoon's not going to win from there. So as we come down to the final quarter mile, and it's San Jose Buddy. San Jose Buddy by a couple to Duke of Finsbury and blinded. How Hume is still looking for racing room. Event Horizon. So it's San Jose Buddy. Takes the last. A little bit slow over it. Blinded. Comes alongside How Hume. It's made some room now. So it's San Jose Buddy. Inside the final half of final. And it's Howard Hume that takes it up. So Howard Hume from blinded. Duke of Finsbury running on well as arse flies. But it's Howard Hume. It had no room. He's going to take this of Darren Thompson from blinded in second. A good win there for Howard Hume with no room. For Darren Thompson takes the Ladsbrook with a the Ladsbrook's hurdle. Gets a winner at the Dublin Festival from blinding in second. Arslice just got up for third there from her event horizon for Josh Shuttleland in fourth. Fire Inferno for Paul Rhodes was fifth. We move on to our last race at Leopardstown, which will be the bumper.